Welcome back to Board of Hip Hop, where we don't listen to no trap, no whack raps, just straight pop. Now, if you guys are new to my channel, you know, make sure you guys do subscribe, and without further ado, let's go ahead and get this thing popping. Now, I've been sick, you know, for a minute, man, so that's the main reason why I really haven't, you know, been uploading or, you know, updating my YouTube channel like that, man. I still feel like shit, you know what I mean? But, you know, I love making, you know, content and videos for you guys, man. So it is what it is. And today we're about to be reacting to Mercury's suicidal, the Sean Kingston diss. And to be honest, I don't know why, you know, Sean Kingston has been pitching off, you know, a whole bunch of rappers lately. I don't know what's up with, you know, this dude, man. But, you know, if you guys know why, you know, Mercury's is, you know, dissing Sean Kingston, comment down below. And I, you know, to me personally, I gotta say this, man. I don't know about you guys, you know, but for me, my opinion, you know, I never saw, you know, Sean Kingston as a gangster or a threat. I always saw him, you know, as a damn, you know, lover boy, you know, that made, you know, music for women and girls like that back in the day, man. And, you know, I think what was it, like six or seven years back, you know what I mean? He had, you know, his little fucking, you know, beef or, you know, on and off, you know, going on, you know, with the gay man. That was fucking funny as fuck to me. Like I said, you know, I never saw this man as a threat. And to see him so fucking pump up, you know, talking all reckless, I was like, oh shit, I was so fucking shocked. I was like, oh man, Sean Kingston turned into a fucking gangster. It was so fucking weird to me, man. You gotta see him nigga, they're the bum, I'm trying to change a heart show, nigga. You trying to change a heart show, what the fuck you talking about? You a disgrace to the blood, nigga. I fuck with real bloods, you whole ass nigga. I wonder how many peanut butter and jelly sandwiches Meek had to make your fat jelly bean smuggling ass. But if you guys, you know, um, remember that, comment down below. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get this thing popping, man. Look, man, I'm going to start by telling you the story. Tell you everything that happened, and then after that, I'm just going to body this motherfucker, okay. man. Look. So Mercury's actually just going to tell us what happened, man. What led, you know, to this dude's fucking, you know, funeral, man. The industry is too funny. This is how it happened. We were supposed to do a song and then you asked me for some money So I sent you two grand, you started oh. acting hella funny Like, send me two more for this video that we'll shoot Dog, the song ain't even finished yet, just get inside the booth Look, this is Let's go back, hold the fuck up I love, you know, when rappers diss someone And they actually have fucking facts, man And screenshots, I love that shit, man We were supposed to do a song and then you asked me for some money So I sent you two grand, you started acting What the fuck, man Yo, man, he's trying to bring funny, my boy. Like, send me two more for this video that we'll shoot. Dog, the song ain't even finished yet. Just get inside the booth. <laughs> this is what we'll do. When it gets a bunch of views, you'll make more money anyway. It's simple, that's the truth. Fact. And he said he really needed it for studio time. I'm like, dog, you're Sean Kingston. Aren't you doing just fine? Then he started sharing his secrets like between you and I. Coronavirus got me broke. That's what I do to get by. Then he hit me on FaceTime like, bro, just do this favor. You're not paying for a feature. You just know I need the paper. So just do this as my friend. I'll record it for you later and our song will be a hit dog i know it's gonna be major nice i was trying to mind my business i was keeping it hush but the last hit he had was when amigos beat him up Ouch. and then three oh, weeks shit. past the song hey, ain't hold up let's go back man my friend i'll record it for you later and our song will be a hit dog i know it's gonna be major nice i was trying to mind my business i was keeping it hush but the last hit he had was the when the last hit this man ever had was when amigos Fucking beat his ass up, man. <laughs> he goes beat him up. Ouch. And then three weeks passed, still the song ain't finished. Then I see he's in the studio like all day chilling. He wow. said that money's not enough. I'm about to drop a song with Bieber. I don't want his life story. All I wanted was the feature. You know what I'm talking about, you fucking <laughs> Scarface. He used to sing about beautiful <laughs> and his No, no. Let's go back, man. Fuck it up, my boy Mercury's got the fucking beautiful girl chorus in there. I don't want his life story. What she saying? All I wanted was the feature. You know what I'm talking about, you fucking girl. Oh, man. He used to sing yeah, about facts, man. See, girl. that's why I think, you know, no one takes, you know, Sean Kingston, you know, for a gangster or some shit like that, man. And I don't know why a whole bunch of fucking rappers right now in the fucking industry, you know, are, you know, pretending to be this and that. And we know they're not, you know what I mean? And his Crazy. career fell off a cliff Now he's broken, suicidal, suicidal Oh man, that's, that's crazy Over he said his manager just told him that we shouldn't do our song Like I'm not relevant enough So this is how I'll prove him wrong You're a whack piece of shit Stop playing I actually want to read the text He said his manager just told him that we shouldn't do our song Like I'm So it's peanuts When I talked about it with my management What? 
I'm not relevant enough, so this is how I'll prove them wrong You're a whack piece of shit, stop playing with me stupid Take that money I sent you and start paying back your jewelers About to take his ass to school, don't show my face cause I'm the shooter You try to play me now, I'll blaze you when you're staying in Vancouver Got him scratching his head now, like how did this happen? I heard you crash your jet ski, I wish you drowned when that happened I don't even want That's the money back, don't talk to me sucker Your career fell off so hard you probably got a concussion <laughs> You don't think we know you're broken, live with mommy, you bugging You're not dropping new music cause it's not doing numbers Facts. Now that paper that I gave you's a deposit for your yeah. casket Plus they say that you a rapist, you've been haunted by your past which is ironic Now in Canada you not gonna get a pass plus a wait, promoter wait, just fight? deposit for your casket Plus they say that you a rapist Oh that's crazy man What the fuck, she was gang raped, what the fuck at a Justin Bieber concert. What the fuck? I never heard about that, man. What the fuck? Rapist, you've been haunted by your past. To be honest, you know, all these rappers, you know, get hit with that, man. Once you do get famous, you know, I don't know, man. Comment down below. But there's not, you know, one rapper who hasn't been accused of, you know, fucking, you know, raping or, you know, doing some weird ass shit, man. Most of them kind of do. Now in Canada, you not going to get a pass. Plus a promoter just told me that it's your mom who spends your cash. Wow. Look at him mad cause he don't got no hits now Tell his fucking goof to beat it like his song with Chris Brown Your 50 oh, minutes is over homie You need to face that He's having flashbacks of way back when he got his chain snatched I ain't even trying It's enough to feed him like jabs Come back to planet earth I think there's something in your strike fam Something tells me you got pics of Usher on your nightstand Who would've thought I'd battle Fucking Justin Bieber's hype man When it's beef I'm with this shit So tell us geek it off my back, dick Here's your favorite it's is over, homie. You need to face that. He's having flashbacks of way back when he got his chain snatched. I ain't even trying. It's enough to feed him like jabs. Come back to planet Earth. I think there's something in your strike, fam. Something tells me you got pics of Usher on your nightstand. Who would have thought I'd battle fucking Justin Bieber's hype, man? Justin Bieber's hype, man. man. Oh man. Beefing with this shit, so tell us geek it off my dick. Here's your favorite. I reminded the scene that you still exist. Homicide in round one. You got nothing left for round two. We're both fat, but I'm losing weight by running laps around you, cocksucker. <laughs> he said we're both fat, but except I'm losing weight for running um raps around you, man. <laughs> what the fuck, man? But old jokes aside, man, um Sean Kingston, he had a lot of hits back then, man. I know um one of my favorite songs was um Gangster featuring um Bun B, man. I don't know if you guys remember that. But other than that, man, I don't know, man. This guy fucking fell off, man. A bunch of fucking, you know, singers and rappers from, you know, the 2000s fucking fell off the, you know, the face of the earth, man. It's crazy, man. But that was Mercury's Suicidal with um, the Sean Keeson Disman. What do you guys rated? Rated from 1 to 10. And see you guys in the next one, man.